Will these new gadgets and gizmos have us reaching for our wallets or the trash? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Between Amazon, TikTok, and Instagram, there is a never-ending lineup of products that are being shoved in our faces, mm. all claiming to make our lives easier. But as we've learned, these newfangled products aren't always as useful as they seem. And I refuse to flush my hard-earned money down the toilet. It's terrible for the plumbing. Mm. So today, we're doing your toilet a favor by finding out which new tools are in fact Worth it. You're welcome. It's time for New Tool or Old School. First up, we have a sunflower seed peeling machine that looks like a pig that is, does it vomit out the seeds? Well, you might think it was a piggy bank for uh, coins that we don't have in this country because they wouldn't fit in that. But this thing has a motor inside and a sensor and you just find a sunflower seed and you put it into the ah, you, the hole. Don't be nervous. That is the smallest hole that it'll still fit in. What? <laughs> okay, so that, that, was, so that, that was too did big. Nothing. So this one. Oh, oh, see, when it gets to the right side, look, look at that. It completely did it. That's the seed, just for you, Link. And it's um, that's a beautiful seed. Look at that. This I can one, do it this, again. This one has a butt. <laughs> oh. You're. Hey man, contain yourself. This is, I, I don't, I mean, how often do we get some little crappy thing from the internet on this show and it actually works as advertised? I mean, this is but mind then it, blowing. If it's too small then. Now it says it has the ability to oh, distinguish one. between good and bad seeds. I think it, what? No, I don't for, believe that. It also for, says it's the best gift for yourself, lover, family, friends, lover, pets. <laughs> I'm gonna give this to my lover. Hey baby, watch this. I'm gonna put my seed in this. Uh, that was okay. I, I didn't. I didn't mean that. That came, okay. that came out wrong. That came out. It's still a one at a time kind of thing. I thought maybe there'd be like some sort of a bin, and then it would do the sorting for you. And All right. Then, well, let's see what you can do on your own. Well, that's what we're going. We're going to do a competition between man. That's that's. Uh, I'm gonna stand in for man today and machine. Yeah. But first of all, what is this button? Power. Um. I don't know. It's got, it's got a little USB okay. butthole. Does it open? And let's then, not let's not break it because it's it's working right now, and I'm amazed by that. And I don't want you to link it. Okay, true. Um, yeah, so it doesn't have to be do turned this. on. I don't think it's just if when it's charged, the sensor's on, or maybe it's already. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, you ready to compete to see who has the most seeds? Well, the only way that Show. I know to to crack a sunflower seed is in my mouth. Well, oh, I'm do you not, need to practice? I'm not gonna eat it. While on that. a road trip. I'm not gonna do that if you eat it. But there's no other. Eat it if you do that. <laughs> You're not gonna. <laughs> I'm not gonna eat your sunflower seeds that have been in your mouth. But what did you say though? I said, I'm not gonna do it if you eat it. I'm not gonna eat it if you do it. I don't know what I said. <laughs> I want you okay. to treat me like I'm your son on a road trip and I actually want to eat the sunflower seeds and if daddy puts them in his mouth, this isn't like you and your grandma and the weird stuff y'all had going on growing up. This is like normal families where you don't eat things out of your relatives' mouths, okay? I know how to blow a bubble with some gum and you don't. <laughs> That's Thank right. Thank you, Nana, for <laughs> so sticking your tongue in my gum. So you're cracking seeds for each other. You're cracking okay. seeds well, not he's already for started. yourself. He's already started. Okay. There's one. I mean, I guess this is The only thing I need is more hands. I mean, it's so much better. It's okay. Well, I don't understand the situation you'd be in in which you would cracking sunflower seeds for someone else. I guess a child? Yeah. A child on a road trip, Stevie. Okay. So much better. But you do have to spit out the majority. I'm not spitting out anything over here. Most sunflower seeds that we have around here are small because I'm going into the two little slots the whole time. I haven't been in one of the big slots yet at all. You know what I just realized? What? These are the things that are in the middle of a sunflower seed, right? Like the big black part you mean a of flower. a sunflower. Yeah, yeah the flower. If you, if that's the seeds, right? Yeah. All the, the big black part in the middle. What in the world? And what do you do? Just rake your hand over it, and all of these fall off? And are they pointing out? I know they're huge and kind of scary, but I've never been in a sunflower field. 
Is that something you can buy a ticket to? I had a sunflower grow in my backyard one time. <laughs> How big did it get? I mean, feet. Many feet. Haven't you seen those TikToks where they take the whole big sunflower head and then they put it on the grill? They put some oil on it and put it on the grill and then they just like shove the entire thing in their mouths. Really? Well, not the entire... I mean, you know, as much of it can fit. I, I didn't want to say that. Uh, to answer your question, no, I haven't. I mean, this is phenomenal. Look what I've done for you. Well, now you have to sort through it. Oh, <laughs> okay. So I'm still going. I've done so many. Now, if it sorted for it automatically, it would be better. It would yep, be better. Still going. But this is something you give this pile to your kid on the road trip, and then they have to do the sorting. And you have to learn a little bit of lesson. You can't have everything done for you, Timmy. I will say that sunflower seeds also good for fishing, and then maybe for baseball. Also mm -hmm. maybe for watching baseball. But those are the only scenarios I can come up with. Oh, I just busted that one where you would want sunflower seeds at all. I feel like I'm still the one distinguishing between the good and the bad Maybe seeds. Maybe on a salad? I don't think the pig did any of Can't that. Can't you put us, aren't they on like buffets? Yeah, some of my favorite buffets have sunflower seeds. <laughs> okay, so you I done? have. You done? Yeah, Wait, I'm done. in that amount of time I did four, two, eight, mm, 12, 15, I got 21 seeds. All right. I, I have 12, but two of them um, were in my mouth at some point. Yeah, I don't wanna eat those. So you've clearly won the race. Yeah. So are we saying new tool? New tool. Did you know that over 10 years ago, we were still doing this show? Yep. And I don't know why I said still. Still doing. We were still doing we it. We were already 10 doing 10 years this in the past. We're still doing it. And this next product we talked about but we didn't have the budget then oh, to have that's it. That's right. This is what we looked like back then. Yeah, we were just in my garage. Other than that, haven't changed a bit. So we talked about the ostrich pillow, but we didn't have it. And now we've got it. It's cool to the touch. It's cool to the look. Is it cool to the look? It kind of looks like it could be like a vest for a, for a child. Is this like the pee pee hole? No, no, this would be like if the doctor needs to take the stethoscope right there and, and still listen to the child's heart. Um, we also use this thing on the tour of Mythicality, like our first tour, we, we, when we brought people on stage, we would uh, we'd put it on their head so that, they, it was basically like a comedic blindfold. So they couldn't see what something that was going on. And we uh, used the same one the entire tour, but we washed it <laughs> between every tour. And by wash it, I mean we just, let it sit on the yeah. bus. We aired it for a out. a couple of days and the bacteria died. We aired it out. But this is what you're supposed to do with it. You're supposed to like take a nap on your desk. Do you want to go first? You want me to I go first? I'd like you to go first. Okay. Uh, I do want to point out as you're putting this on, Link, um, that if you look at the advertisement for this thing in one of the original pictures, I believe if you would cover your eyes up and do just like this guy does, showing your mouth and your nose, like that? You are the model for the original picture. Do I, I have the same mouth and nose? No chin. No you chin? You don't show okay. the chin. Okay. You show just the bottom of the mouth. Is that me? It, Am I the ostrich pillow nose and mouth guy? You look, ex I mean, that you, he has the exact same, are you sure you weren't taken, uh, you weren't, do you remember being kidnapped about 10 years ago and being driven somewhere and then having something put over your head and then like hear, feeling like a flash? Bulb. I'm a heavy sleeper and I take long naps. I might have uh, might have given somebody a free talent. Okay. Talent. I've got uh, the this appearance like a traditional. Uh, what am I? This thing's four, this is go. only fourteen dollars. I mean, and then these are just you for can, for cuddling your hands and also for being able to hear. I can still. I can. I can hear. I can hear just as well as I could a, a second ago. I don't ever. I don't like these travel pillows. I, I don't. It does. They don't work for me. Something about the way I'm shaped. The problem with leaning over like this is that it does something to let air into my stomach and then I like wake up like with the, these big burps. I don't like that. This I think is, the problem with this thing is- This is not a good way to nap. What you look like in the plane. <laughs> oh, we're on a plane. On. We're on a plane now? You know? 
No one's wearing this thing because if they were, they would be. There would be so many TikToks of like, hey, the guy next to me on the plane is wearing this thing. He's also sleeping on me right now. Is, okay. that, is this is this accurate? Um, you usually don't lean on me. I usually push you back to the other person, <laughs> like that. Now here's a real test. It though. gets warm in here quick, man. Let's say if things got turbulent, it's hot in here, and I needed to use a barf bag, I would have no trouble. I would have no trouble just, just. Uh, I would have no trouble barfing. Let me but try. What would you do? Uh, I'd barf. You know? Could you? This is the barf hole. Yeah, but this is where the barf comes from. It looks from. like we're gonna get barf on this on, uh, the, on the sides of it. Let, you know? Uh, then you just air it out. Is it, can you get the bag to seal completely around it? Uh, like if you go inside, uh, like, uh, uh, like this, so that the bag. It's completely sealed on every side so that the only thing barf yeah. hits is bag. Yeah, yeah. So okay. basically it's just com complete <laughs> and then I'm just completely sealed. Uh, okay, you, I, you probably need to get on the plane like that. Uh, you, need, uh, <laughs> you, you just, you just uh, walk. Just, just walking around walk, dunking in this stuff? Walk. Ow. Yeah, yeah, I'll be with you. All right. Can I keep my hands in 27 here? 27C, you're there, Link, sit down. Oh no, well what if we, I don't know, I kind of feel like we could complete the look. Take your hand out. Uh, you can barf out of e any hole. Uh, this is just a hundred dollar gimmick, man. This is how he's gonna walk on the plane. Uh, no, I'm not with uh, this man. No, no, I'm not with this man. Uh, I'm just directing him to his seat. Uh, I'm a little too hot in the head area. You right look now. like something that would be in like a, a B movie Guillermo del Toro ripoff. I don't. Something I don't, you'd run into in a maze somewhere. I like wearing a mask on a plane. With oh, I a like the way the bag him. moves when you talk. Keep talking. I don't have anything else to say. Move your mouth more. What else do I say? Open, open wider. I don't know what to do. I can't think when I can't see. Okay, Link, I didn't try it on and I don't want to. Uh, so, uh, $100. $100, 4.1 stars out of five on Amazon. I don't think people are really loving this thing. I mean, it looks great, but how do you feel? Uh, okay. I feel too hot. I feel I feel stupid, but I do like it when people are looking at me. Yeah. And I feel like that we're, we're would aware be accomplished. Of that. <laughs> but it's not enough. I'm saying old mm. school for this one. All right, we're gonna go with this, even though I don't even like this one. I just dislike it less than what you're wearing. Tomorrow, I am turning another year older in the way I am alleviating the sting of being 44. Ouch! It's by giving you stuff. That's right. You can get up to 20% off some of my favorite items over at the Mythical Store through the 13th. Okay, so go over there to mythical.com. And also, we got some discounts on the Mythical Society. 10% off all first degree plans, 20% off all second and third degree plans. Wow. And that goes through the 18th, celebrating birthday week all week. Wow, Rhett, with all those deals that you're just hammering us with, I forgot how old you were getting. What is it? <laughs> Can you tell what I, what I say when I say What is it? I am gonna give you this next thing oh. as a birthday present I'll be tomorrow if we choose new tool. And I'm actually pretty excited about this. Okay. I did not know that you could create a hard-boiled golden egg yep. by scrambling the innards of an egg Crazy. and keeping the shell intact. And There's I don't know exactly why you'd wanna do this. I guess if you're grossed out by the idea of that just like yolk. Me. I don't like the yolk part of a hard-boiled egg. So this fantastic $15 on Amazon device might be exactly what I need. Look at egg rocket. Well, it's almost like a deep sea diver type thing. And I'm gonna do the old school method, which is actually new school to me, but um, there's a YouTube video that we watched by some, what is it, what is the guy's name? Hawkin, Knight Hawkin Light. Uh, Knight Hawkin Light. I don't know if he like came that. up with it, but he made a video about it that explains how you can take uh, it's gonna take me a second because I have to tie okay, this well, thing in. I'll show you how to do this because I also need to prep this. You turn that, you take that apart, you take this little little submersible, you you open up the hatch, and look at that, it is begging for an egg. This part right here is um, 
Rubber always use protection. Mm -hmm. And I guess any egg, nope, only eggs that fit are the size that, hmm. Does your egg fit or do you get a big egg? Do I just smush it? I no, mean, no, no, you I don't. think I just smush it. No, you don't. Right? Or do I take this out? Is this for like, just take, one take one, are you making this up? No. This one's smaller, this egg smaller. Okay, that one's smaller. And then I take this and I keep that in there because it's like the cushion. It's a cushion. Because I'm gonna spin the crap out of this thing. Oh! <laughs> I'm so relieved. Okay. What's that white stuff? Is that egg? No, no that, that's the that's decoration. Okay. And then I put it back on here. Are you ready? I'm so ready. And then I put this back on there. I've got my egg in a sock and I'm so ready. And then all I gotta and do is yank on this. That's not a euphemism for anything. You put you put it ready in there. Ready to go, son? Yes, I got it. my egg in the sock. Yep, and you're gonna yank on it. No, I'm gonna yank no, on I'm it. I'm gonna spin it. You're and gonna pull spin it. it, spin it and pull it. Spin and I'm gonna yank. It. Yes, we're gonna go at the so same what time. I do according to Night and Hawk Light, Light Light Night Hawk Light, Night Light and Hawk. I don't know what it is. I said it right the first time. It's gonna go like this. Oh gosh! And then pull. Are you ready? Yep. Okay. Pull. And then I'm just gonna go. Like. <laughs> well, that. I, can you hear me? Maybe if I do this, I can tell you did this. Am I doing it right, Nighthawk? I've had a lot of practice doing this. Back in my lawnmower days. I can't get it started. Gosh, how am I gonna mow if I can't get my lawnmower started? All the neighbors are watching. I'm so embarrassed. I wish I had an ostrich pillow to put over my head. That would make this funnier. I was asking for the ostrich pillow to go on my head. But nobody's listening to me. Thanks, guys. For nothing. Okay, I don't know if I did it or not, Nighthawk, but. Oh my gosh. Well, first of all, this is a workout. Man. My heart rate's up. Well, let's try to spin a sock. <laughs> and then uh, all I gotta do is take this off. Did you think, break an egg? Yeah. Is that your underarms? I don't know, some, something stinks. It smells like baloney. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> it smells mean. like baloney. Okay, you know what? It's still intact. And now I'm gonna write on this thing. What am I gonna so write? you can tell the difference between our eggs. Can I get some skizzers? I'm gonna write new tool on this one. Oh, they see they listen to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the way I say things, Link. All right, so we're gonna boil this. I sound, I sound serious. <laughs> so now. Nighthawk, here you go. I've got a perfectly golden egg. We cannot, well we can't tell yet. We're gonna boil it, and then we're gonna, we're gonna see what it tastes like. How long did it take us to boil these eggs? Uh, we boiled them, they were actively boiling for 10 minutes, and then they've been sitting for about seven. So about as long as it takes to film the more for uh -huh. this episode? Yeah, yeah, don't tell anybody. Okay, let's put and, these and in. Ju the, and just in case you in didn't the, know. In the cold. You can mark, you can mark up your eggs and boil them, and it'll, and the sharper you'll stay on. I'm glad, because now we still know that this is the new tool. Dropping them into some cold water. I do not know what this is gonna look like. Um, I don't believe that mine is gonna be fully scrambled. And I don't know if it's gonna, is this, is this long enough? Apologies to the Nighthawk. All right, so. It will be I, user error if it doesn't work. What you wanna do here? Uh, you're gonna probably, I mean, it's gonna be pretty hot. What do you mean? So, do are you they, want me to wait? They, have they cooled down? No. Do we need to? Uh, how about another time wipe? What do you want to do now? Yeah, let's just do another time wipe. Uh, okay, let's shoot another more. Uh, women. Huh. Can't live with them? No, I got that wrong. <laughs> women. You can only live with them. That's right. The whole the water is all hot now. I don't I don't know how to. <laughs> I wouldn't call that hot. I would call that lukewarm. And I think we're probably good to go at this point. Now I'm expecting yours to be better than mine. Right. Because you had the new tool. Why don't you do, oh, look at that now. I don't even know what to expect. The whole egg is gonna be gold? Do this one too. There you go. Riveting content. Should we do it another clockwise perhaps? I don't know. I've never had an egg stick so hard to itself. <laughs> maybe, maybe you should, what about a clockwise? 
Okay. Um, so you can, as you can see, nothing, ha nothing. You failed, dude. I didn't do it right. All right. So now I'm having so much struggle right now. I think now that you've cooled it down, though, it'll peel more easily. Okay. There you go. I'm gonna let you. You gonna make me do it? Yeah, I, I've never done it, and I don't want to do it. Come on, be gold. Be gold. Be gold. Be clock wipe. I've never wanted to reach through the screen so badly. What is but, wrong but, with me? But you still don't want to get up and walk over here. I will. Okay, we overboiled it. Here's what we're gonna do now. Clock wipe. Ooh, gross. See, look. Ooh, it looks. It's, it's, it's what, actually green. What color is that? It's green. Oh my god. But the it is completely homogenous, unlike. My egg. Oh wow! Look, there's no. This is this is this is just. Don't overboil your eggs, kids. This is the look of spherical defeat. I want to taste it though. I'm gonna get a clean, non-shelled piece. Oh, what? Better late than never. Yep. I was. That was. Wait, wait. It actually is not bad. It tastes like egg white and egg yolk together. But boil. Boy, was that worth it. I, I prefer just the egg white. <laughs> I really do. I you mean, don't like the yolk. Yeah, I don't like the yolk. And you, you basically, instead of removing the part I didn't like, now it has infiltrated the part that I did like. And it's not golden. It's a little bit putrid green, which is not a great look. So we are saying. Hold on. If you. New to old school. No. No old tool. Just because you don't like it doesn't mean that it's not a good tool. I am saying. It does exactly what is I advertised. I trust women. So we're saying <laughs> new tool. It does work. Sorry, Nighthawk. It works, yes, but I didn't prefer it. Who would want to do it? But it does work. Okay, so that means we actually tried two contra contraptions today. Three. That actually tried do work. Oh, really, really? And a third one that just makes you look stupid. Um, so this, I'd this, say we're this batting, is the real winner. We're batting six, 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 six. <laughs> you, I, something about this did feel cursed. <laughs> Thanks for subscribing. Click the bell. <laughs> you know what time it is. This is Rachel and I'm Lauren, and we just ate at Donut Prince in LA. Don't get a divorce, get a donut, and it's time to spin, spin the, the wheel, wheel of mythicality. Words to live by. <laughs> yep, yep. You're still up there. <laughs> We came up with it somehow. Click the top link to watch us guess what kind of products weird slogans are selling in Good Mythical More. And to find out where the Will of Mythicality is going to land. I've got a reverse birthday gift for you. Enjoy some of my favorite items in the Mythical store at up to 20% off now through October 13th. Mythical.com.